Hello, this is Okuda Shitake. It's been 71 days from the inoculation. I think some of you don't know how to enjoy with Miru Shitake in this season. Spawn has spread and dried. You may think mold maybe? That's a weak point of this. <laughs> anyway, it doesn't show its progress to us clearly. But there is a point that is enjoyable. That is browning. Please enjoy that the white mycelium turns into brown color. It gets bigger bit by bit every day. The air tends to make white mycelium brown. For the most part, this change happens into this season. So don't miss it. It's been 72 days from the inoculation. Today, I'll put back this log in the bag. It has dried for about 7 days. Let's take a look first. It still holds tiny trichoderma. It does not seem to be active because of low humidity. Keeping the humidity high in the bag may cause recolonization of trichoderma again. But too long dryness is also not good for shiitake mycerium. So I'll keep the zipper open. I put it in the bag upside down. At this time, you need to pay attention to mold's recolonization from not enough dryness or too high humidity and spawn dead because of giving a too long time to dry the log. And please be aware of these two points as a reference. It's been 73 days from the inoculation. These two logs used to be similar. Both logs had blue mold on their surface. One of them was washed and dried. Another one was not done anything. This washed and dried log looks clean. The other one is more like stronger. I suppose mycelium stuck to the bag and got thicker. Then it strengthens its defense. So the myceliums are building up blue mold. That happens because it's just normal blue mold. It is not as strong as trichoderma. So let's take a look at it. The water at the bottom is so much. Here is the trichoderma. It is not good. Mm. This time I will let it be because I'm curious what's going to happen. It's been 74 days from the inoculation. I will apologize previously. Today, this is a video regarding mold again. You may think, again? But it's pretty hard to keep good conditions for Miru shiitake log in this season. So here are about 10 shiitake logs and it gets mold at random. It makes videos regarding mold a lot. I expect that I will make many videos about hot temperature and dryness in this summer. Actually, these logs have been on the video since day 72. The logs had small areas of mold on them. So I washed and dried just in case. So it was like switching with this log. It is a good point to put some stick on the other log. It makes it dry all over the surface. It's been 75 days from the inoculation. I always take these videos in the mornings. Becoming a habit takes an average of 66 days. And today, it's been about 66 days since the first video. Now, taking a video is my habit, so I'll keep posting it to the end. Okay, so I'm going to take a look at these logs. Some of shiitake farmers worry and think it has too many mycerium come out, but we don't really care. It shows how mycerium went through. It's good, isn't it? It does not get dented if I push the holes. And another log. This one too. Good. And I don't see any moles. So I'll put them in the bags to keep moisture. It's been 76 days from the equation. Today, I'm going to show a new way of control mill shiitake. It's interesting, this one. Do you see the difference? Yes, the log is wrapped in a plastic wrap. To tell you why it's wrapped, it has three reasons. 
keeping moisture, avoiding mold, and promoting growth of mycelium. You may understand keeping moisture because plastic wrap doesn't let anything go through, even a span of mold. Wrapping is also helps spreading mycelium, like this. For example, this slug has kind of similar condition. It's almost wrapped in the plastic bag, and mycelium touches the bag grows well. So that is the effect of wrapping. Some of you may say, why didn't you sell me shiitake like that? <laughs> I'm sorry, it is still in testing, and we don't know when the wrap is supposed to be taken off yet. If it will be successful, we will adapt this idea next season. It's been 77 days from the inoculation. Today I'm going to check these two logs. The logs have been here for 3 weeks, with a new way of management. But the log got mauled with 99% of humidity. This log has mauled here. So another one has mauled here. And this one. And here. It's not so bad. But I should wash and dry it just in case. So it's pretty risky to manage the log with no touching. It should be repeating dry and covered conditions. Please try to repeat the routine with effort if you don't mind. We recommend to take care of it with dry condition mainly in rainy season. That's all for today. We are going to soak the logs in 132 days. Now I post videos of Mirushitake every day. If you are curious, please subscribe and leave a like. We and the logs will be motivated. See you next time.